It's important to have representation in engineering. Inclusive design and designing for true accessibility is something that I really care about and has to be considered and is so important to have that accessible, inclusive design. The research experience for undergraduate program is funded by the National Science Foundation and it's aimed at providing research internships to undergraduates who are interested in pursuing degrees in science and engineering. We focus on giving opportunities to students in STEM in an effort to help provide them experiences that they don't have at their home institutions and spur them into future careers in science and engineering or graduate school. My name is Riley Nicholson. I am a rising senior at Penn State University, majoring in mechanical engineering and minoring in engineering design. In my classes, I can say that the split between men and women is about 85-15. Coming to CHOP, where it is such a female-dominated program in every discipline, which is really impressive to see and was really exciting to see that I was working on a team with other women. My name is Shakota, and I go to Arizona State University and I'm finishing up my last semester studying human systems engineering. Human systems engineering is definitely very broad which is why I went into it and why I really like it. You can just really pick your niche. I wanted to do something more health related and also just to come back to like my own community and like my, my own people. So training has always been a, a passion and a mission of the Center for Research and Prevention and CHOP as a whole. Uh, kind of training the next generation of injury scientists is needed because uh, there is a shortage of scientists in this field and we make it part of our mission and my personal mission to see to it that we bring bright young minds into this field.